Good morning. My name is Larry Anderson, FDIC 2010. This is the Hearst booth. We're going to introduce a couple new products. This is the Hearst Jaws of Life Concrete Crusher. as a combination concrete crusher, rebar cutter. Works on our high pressure system. Works off a backpack power unit, electric power unit, or gas operated. Opening is 10 inches at the open. Works ideally on 4 inch to 8 inch concrete. Doesn't matter what PSI the concrete is. And as you get deep enough, you get into the reinforcing steel, rebar, and wire. It has the ability to cut inch and a quarter rebar. Next to this is our hydraulic jack system. This is our MSM valve, which controls the operation of the hydraulic jacks. This is our direction control to raise or lower. And this is our speed control. So one power unit, the circuit off one power unit, can operate two jacks. This is one of our hydraulic cylinders. We have over a dozen different cylinders, different applications, single acting, double acting. This is a double acting hydraulic cylinder, has three pistons. First piston, four inches of travel, 141,000 pounds of force. Second piston, four inches of travel, 65,000 pounds of force. And the third piston, also four inches of travel, 22,000 pounds of force. Double acting, power up, power down. And again, it operates off a rescue power unit. The MS-7 valve can be placed up to 100 feet away from the power unit. And the cylinder can be 66 feet away from the manifold. So you got a 166 foot lead out. Okay, here we're at our forcible entry door showcasing some of our forcible entry equipment. New mass here has got our backpack power unit using a combination tool, simulating forcing the door at the middle of the door, working off the door frame, pushing off the lock mechanism or the door, uh, door uh, the doorbell there. The backpack, 24 volt, 9 amp hour battery, about 45 minutes of operation, permanent magnet electric motor, pump block, our piston block, bellows diaphragm reservoir. So there's no air in the system. You can wear it, be bent over, lay it down. There's no air in the system. You're not going to cavitate the pump. This operates all our high pressure tools. It'll operate our full size spreaders, our 236,000 pound cutters, even operate the small rams. So the 51,000 pound spreaders, our 120,000 pound cutter combination tool, so whether you're breaking, breaching, lifting, or moving heavy objects, it's portable power goes anywhere. Our LKE 55, kind of showcasing down here at the bottom of the door frame. Also, you can use the combi tool. You get the Detroit bars that will reinforce the back of the doors. <clears throat> Extra reinforcing on the latch and the hinge. One of the techniques that they can be used is pushing off the floor to the bottom of the door. Kicks the door up. The Detroit bar can fall out you got your way in and then whatever other reinforcements. So the LKE55 is our self-contained combination cutter spreader, quick change battery, 24 volt 2.4 amp hour battery, weighs 34 pounds. Battery, motor, pump, reservoir all built into the tool. Throw the switch, 12 and a half inches of travel, 17,500 pounds of spread force, 30,000 middle of the arm, 56,000 pound cutter. So it's an ideal tool to go to rooftops, basements, behind buildings, cable, chain, rebar, whatever gets in the way. You're getting most of your traffic, Larry. Right now, our mini light tools, mini light tools that were designed to work in small places where you couldn't get a full-size tool. Ideally in a full well area where you can't get a full-size tool, the occupants in the vehicles, their lower extremities are trapped, can't get them loose. So the small tools, Here we go. little eight inch spreader, weighs 10 pounds, eight inches of travel, generates 7,300 pounds of force. So whether you're using the hand pump or our battery operated power unit.
two-stage pump, two-stage mechanical. We all know the spreaders, when they're full close to full open, have different forces. So to get generate the maximum spread force of 7,200 PSI uh, pounds force, this wedge between the arms gives you 7,000 pounds of force right from the get-go. So it's a single acting piston, dump the pressure, either spring or a load return. This is our new Milwaukee power unit. That's a combination of Milwaukee drill with our pump system. It's a two-stage pump. Uh, flow, it has a two-quart reservoir, operates all the single acting tools. So with this spreader, just say you're making space, you got to continue making more space, lifting and moving heavy objects. We can take our small ram. This ram goes inside the 8-inch travel. It goes up to 10 and a half inches. With this ram fully extended, the large ram can go inside of that go up to 14 and a half inches. Both rams can generate 10,000 pounds of force. Our C-frame cutter, mini cutter, it's a point-on-point -point cutter. 17,000 pounds of cut force, cuts 5 eighths rebar easily. Get bigger rebar, hit it, rotate 90 degrees, intersect, hit it again, you can cut up to 3 quarter inch rebar that way. HP combo tool. This is our hand operated combination cutter spreader. Has 10 inches of travel, maximum 24,000 pound spread force, 46,000 pound cut capability. This is a selector valve. This is a two stage pump. Power close, power open. Select which mode you want to work in. So it's a two stage pump. Put a 1,000 pound load in the system shifts into the pressure mode. Now should something interfere with the operation of the handle and obstacles or whatever, put the selector valve in the neutral position and you can rotate the head 360, get your handle out into a better position, ease of operation. Thank you very much. Thanks Larry.